Hey friends, David Shirey, author of Rare Confidence. It's going to be available to you in just a couple of days. Listen, today I want to ask you why you take it so personally. Why do you take rejection so personally in business and in life? You know, if you are in sales, don't you understand by now that the more no's you get, get you closer to a yes? But not only that, every single no is a learning experience. It should be a teachable moment to figure out why you or your idea was rejected. And if you use it that way, it won't be something that hurts. It'll be something that helps. Every time you reach out to a potential customer and they shun you or turn you away or don't take your call or tell you that your offering isn't good enough or can't help them, what is it that you can learn from that? Hey, if you ask that beautiful girl out on a date and she says, you know, you're not my type, there's probably something that you can learn from that as well. But in business as in life, rejection is going to happen all the time. Now, people aren't always personally rejecting you as a loser. Get out of my face. I never want to see you again. You're horrible. That's not what it is at all. But people who lack confidence often take it that way. And they take it as their whole person is being rejected, not just their concept or idea or price point or offering or whatever it may be. So understand that rejection really is a part of life. If that didn't happen, everybody in the world would be gazillionaires and that probably would be chaos in its own right. Learn from rejection. Figure out why they said no. Learn from it and move on. David Shirey, we'll talk again next time.